So today I'm gonna be using a five foot ultralight with, I think it's a Path Panther Martin spinner. And I'm also gonna be using this ice fishing rod. I'm hoping to hook something with this because that will be fun. That's gonna make a little trout feel like a five pound bass. So that's the goal today, but we're gonna start off fishing this little pocket right here, this little eddy. So hopefully we can pull something up. That will be dope. I'm gonna throw this guy in the bag until I can find some fish. I'm just gonna continue using this. And then if I find some fish, I'll switch over to that little ice rod. I just got 10 pound braid to I think like eight pound fluoro. Water starting to slow down a little bit. Starting to see some slack water, so that's good. Some ambush points. We gotta just get one, boys. Oh, fish on. Right where I thought. Yep. Let's go, baby. First one. First one. Called that, too. Perfect little ambush point under those branches. Oh my god. Just beautiful. Beautiful fish. I already had my hands wet, so he should be fine. He came out and crushed it. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's get back in this spot right here. This whole little brush line. It's kind of like a little undercut. And that's right where that fish came. I was just pitching in there, reeling upstream, and he came out and smacked it. I know there's some big ones in here. You just gotta find them. Gotta keep looking in that juice. Oh. Um. Going pro. Oh. Getting deep, bro. looks too good not to have a trout. Oh, got one. Fish on. Fish on. Let's go, baby. Let's go. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. Let's fucking go. That spot, like I like I said, I'm calling the shots right now. That spot looks too good. Oh, he destroyed it. Right, let's get the release on this beautiful guy. Oh. Well, chill, dude. Gonna help you out. See you. So guys, all I'm doing is throwing this little spoon in areas like this. There's a deep pool and there's a little eddy on the other side threw right into the eddy slow rolled it and he came out and clobbered it i'm just letting it sink drift in the water pretty awesome we're gonna continue on down the creek See if we can find some more productive water. It's a little fast right here. 
Ooh. It's looking juicy down here. All right, <laughs> I'm on. Of course, I didn't have the camera rolling, but we got another little guy. I'm hyped. I went upstream like maybe a week ago and it was very small i just i was micro fishing this uh is a lot more productive a lot more water but just a beautiful fish I'm not gonna get a picture of this guy we're just kind of oh come here dude just gonna let him go See you, Junior. Guys, this looks crazy. There's like a whole bunch of downed trees, a lot of pools, and some little waterfalls, but this spot looks juice. I'll flip you guys around so you can see. Yeah, this spot looks good. We're gonna catch some fish. Oh, fish on, fish on. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. It's a little, little guy, but I don't even care. All right, guys, we're gonna let him go. Little Jimmy. And he's off. All right, guys, I am headed back to the car. It's getting kind of dark. I really don't want to be like an hour away from my car when it starts getting dark oh, around here. It's a little sketchy, but it was a good day. Caught, I think three or four fish, one decent sized trout. So I am super hyped about that. I've never been down this part of the creek before. Only my second time here, so I can't complain, but I might fish one other hole where we caught that bigger trout earlier and then I'm heading out so I'll see you guys there All right, guys, that's gonna be it for me today. It was a good day. We caught trout. I caught a decent sized one for this creek. I know there's some bigger ones in here, but you know, we'll find them eventually. Um, thank you so much for watching this whole video. I appreciate it. If you like my video, subscribe, leave a comment. But well, that's all I got for you guys today. I will catch you on the next one. Keep trying to find that juice. Peace.